Hello, I am going to be solving today's New York Times crossword puzzle. This is June 2nd, 2020, and I'm going to be talking my thoughts out loud as much as possible as I solve it. Uh, if you'd like to follow along, you can see the clues toward the top of the screen in red. All right, let's give this a go. Knickers wearer, maybe. Uh, let's see. Prefix, that's going to be unicellular or unicycle. I like to do the short ones first. Prefix with laryngeal, I'm not sure, coffee informally could be Java, um, spy, that's probably the CIA, uh, a lot of it is spam, that's got to be email, of course, um, that is the uh, Ural C, or the Aral, uh, I can never remember, both of them are kind of crossword easy, um, let's see, order at an auto shop, that's going to be a lube job, not a bad, one, one down, um, let's see, knickers wearer, maybe. Why don't I know this? A lad, I guess? Deny any responsibility for. Um, huh. I feel like everyone watching is screaming the answer. I just can't see this for some reason. All right, give life to is going to be animate. Nice. Uh, I still don't know this. Puzzle is B. Be news, be something. View off the coast of Miami. That's um, Biscayne Bay, I think. Okay, I already see eBay is in these circled letters, so that is somehow theme related, an online company. Um, deny any responsibility, it's gonna be disavow. I don't know what otolaryngology is, but uh, I will take the puzzle's word for it. Let's see, a no vote is a nay. Uh, gin rummy. Common language suffix, ease, like Chinese. Heavenly beings, okay, that's gonna be angels, good. Uh, neighbor of Tunisia is gonna be Libya. Oh my god, I can't spell. Libya. All right, Yang's partner is Yin. Match up as a phone with a computer is sync. What's this? Ingredients in gorp are raisins. This cargo is obviously a snail. Let's see what this is. One who helps you hit just the right note. Um, what is it? Auto tuner or something, but uh, I'm not seeing it. All right, let's go up here. Like the anagramming of a decimal point to make I'm a dot in place. <laughs> Apt, <laughs> maybe? Okay, we'll find out. That's kind of a fun clue. Big fib, probably a lie. Bruce Lee. Uh, what? It's not Santa Claus, Mrs. Claus. Interesting clue for Mrs. I like that. First stroke. Um, apt could be wrong. Pokes through. Some, I have something wrong. Like Wabash College. I guess that's all male, so maybe I don't have something wrong. Egyptian queen is Cleo. Um, let's go over here. Bidding. Oh, I don't know pro golfers. Okay pokes through, pierces. Okay, I should have seen that before. First stroke is T, ooh, is this a golf term too? Something T, uh-oh. All right, bidding. Okay, let's go, does this make sense? One who helps you hit just the right note. Why am I still not seeing this? And I also don't, these, Circled letters, I don't see like an internet company that belongs in there, but all right, the puzzle will fill itself in eventually, um, I am sure. Kind of bean mentioned memorably, that's fava beans and a nice candy. Kiln is an oven. Whip is to flog. Puzzle, that's bewilder, what a lovely word. Chris with the 1991 hit. Wicked game. Hmm. I don't know. Not, not right now. Secures as a climber's rope. Probably will end in S. Um, quo. Let's see. Attachment to a rope to make a tree swing. Car tire. That's a evocative clue for car tire. Wow. It, I would have come up with a hundred clues before that, and that's what makes me love this. All right. One who helps you 
hit just the right note. Vocal coach, ah, uh, very nice. I guess tee shot, that makes sense. The first stroke in golf, you hit off the tee. Um, sorry, golf fans, for not getting that sooner. I still don't know who the golfer Lorena is bidding. I don't know. I'm sorry. Quo, I don't know this either. All right, patron of sailors. Is it a saint? Is flog wrong? I think flag might also mean, I might be making that up. Flag might also mean to whip, but let's find out. Mideast ruler could be an emir. Um, tears is rips, good. Spots on our radar screen are blips. Okay, we're moving. St. Elmo, good. Some workers on standby are EMTs. Uh, let's go here, impersonates, imitates. Um, oh, behest bidding. Why is behest not working for me here? It's my best guess right now. Chris, okay. So what is this, by the way? Maybe I just don't know what Alcoa is. I obviously know Intel. These are tech companies inside of circles. I don't yet know why they are inside circles, but I am assuming that 56 across is going to reveal that information for us. Blue hue, cyan, um, aqua. Let's get more. Yak or yap. High hit to the outfield. Maybe a pop, like a pop fly. Drive through convenience, ATM maybe. Something's wrong here. These letters are not working together, but tip of a shoe is a toe. Let's find out what's wrong. Cute pudginess in a toddler is baby fat. That's a nice entry. Um, on a par with is maybe equal to. And then aqua looks good here. Oh joy, I drew the short straw again. Lucky me. Nice. Okay, it was fly, not pop. Makes sense. Secures as a climber's rope. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's not flag. Huh. I want to put Isaac here. I don't know, because Buccaneers looks right. Science fiction hero of the 25th century. Hmm, something's not clicking with me here. Songs of Little Wayne, Little Yachty, or Little Uzi. I'm gonna guess those are raps. Santa Ana wins. Broadcasting on air. Washington Airport name. Let's see, Oolong is a T. Gear Tooth is, um, I guess, a cog. Go out on a limb. Washington Airport name is Reagan. Al Capone Chasers. That's gonna be um, uh, G Men. I think. First half of an LP is side one. Um, Buck Rogers. What is Krog? On guard. Okay, here's the revealer. Go their separate ways or a description of these long entries. Go their separate ways is part company. Okay, so I guess this revealer means that part of these answers is the name of a company or that these companies sell parts. Intel sells parts of computers. I suppose you could buy parts of things on eBay. Uh, I'm not actually that familiar with Alcoa. I don't even know if Krog, if Buck Rogers is right. Um, so this revealer isn't really snapping into place for me. Unless it is like that part of the entries are company company names, um, but I could be missing something. Let's see. Ticket issuer. Cop. Number under a line. Hmm. Street. Beef. Let's see. Plaid designs. Huh. Eleanor Rigby, thank you for a gimme. I needed it over here. No more seats, that's SRO, sold right out. We is opposite. Uh, I guess is no. 
How do you say no in French? Response to, did you win the lottery? <laughs> I don't know. Allah, probably. Plaid designs are number under a line. Why am I not seeing this? Oh, it's probably T-men, and it's to pay. What is going on in this section? Do I have something terribly wrong? Street cred makes sense. Uh, sadly, no. Interesting, interesting entry. Okay, total, obviously. Sorry, I was so slow there. Let's see. Is this flag be lags? No, I have something wrong. Let's find out what it is. Oh, belaze and flay makes sense. Okay, so that's the puzzle. I had a rougher time with this one than I usually do on Tuesdays. Uh, partly because I didn't know Alcoa and... Oh, this is... Kroger, I don't know why I kept saying Krog. The E and the R are circled here. Okay, so this says Kroger. I definitely know that company. Um, so, okay, I know three out of the four. And that now convinces me that uh, it's not that these companies sell parts, because Kroger doesn't sell parts. It's just that part of the theme entry is a company name. Um, all right, that, that's a fine theme. Uh, not super exciting. Um, and something just wasn't clicking with me about this puzzle. I did find this crossing, um, this behest H crossing to be particularly difficult. Um, but, and I don't know, the theme, I guess it works unless I'm missing something, but it, it just didn't snap together for me. Um, you want a revealer to really like um, provide an aha moment. And I sort of, once I got eBay, I sort of already knew, okay, company names are inside of the theme ent entries, but um, you'd like to get more of a satisfying aha when you get to re a revealer, but part company, it's also just not a particularly exciting phrase. Um, that being said, there's a lot to like about this puzzle. Uh, for instance, I mean, considering it is a themed puzzle with, what is this, five theme entries, um, it has a lot of long bonus stuff. Look at these corners, all like seven letter triple stacks and plus extra seven letter entries at 14 across and 61 across. And they're pretty well used, like lube job, animate, disavow. Okay, animate and disavow aren't like the most exciting fill, but it's super clean over here. And lube job is an interesting one down. Um, also tee shot, pierces, and all male. Again, a very clean corner. Nice work, with the exception of this H. That was probably the compromise that was made to get this clean and otherwise nice corner. Um, also over here, baby fat is a lucky entry. Also with lucky me, a very colloquial phrase. Uh, no complaints about that. And um, this section was a little rough around the edges for me. Looking at it again, it's kind of just my fault. Um, this is not uh, going in easy for me. And sadly, no, just hit my ear a little strangely as a standalone phrase for a crossword puzzle. but. Looking at it now, there's nothing really to complain about. Um, I'd say this is a well-constructed puzzle, not exactly scintillating, but um, a perfectly serviceable job. Uh, all right, thanks. And I'm going to be posting more videos of me solving crossword puzzles, both at a leisurely pace and um, speed solving, as well as other puzzle-related content. So chess puzzles, logic puzzles, and all sorts of good stuff. So if you're into that kind of thing, check out my channel. And thanks a lot for watching.